In my laboratory, we're very interested in the disease lupus, and this is a disease that occurs primarily in women and is characterized by the cells that are making antibodies. And when those antibodies get into the circulation, they can end up both causing inflammation throughout the body and can cause tissue destruction. The most common symptom that lupus patients have is fatigue and just feeling unwell and exhausted and unable to function like their normal self. Biomedical research is the studies that we do so that we can understand disease processes so that we can improve the way we maintain people's health and the way we treat their diseases. And so we have learned how to co-opt some of the drugs that have been used in cancer chemotherapy to use in lupus and suppress the inflammation and eliminate some of the cells that are causing disease. And that's very important. We've learned which are the cells that make the disease-specific antibodies. We've made it clear that that's where we have to focus our therapies. And there are some targets that one can look at to try to intervene in that process and prevent all these autoantibodies from being made in lupus patients. But we need more research because we need better therapies and better therapies don't happen without better understanding of the disease itself and clinical trials, which are partnerships between patients and researchers and physicians to actually move what we learn about disease and see if it actually works when you take it to a patient with a problem. I think we are a world-class research group because we integrate laboratory models of disease, clinical research, and clinical trials. I want to cure lupus. So I'd like to be able to identify it early and stop the process so that people can have decades of drug-free existence. I love seeing patients get better. I love when we make a discovery in the lab that really explains something to us that we haven't understood before. I can't imagine a more gratifying kind of work to do.